Good afternoon. Welcome to Jim Munley's World of Weather. I clicked on to the long range weather forecast discussion for November 28th through December 12th. And a happy Thanksgiving to everyone. Um, we're going to look at the period now for November 28th through December 2nd. And the pattern remains amplified. We still have strong positive height anomalies here, keeping a trough here over the east. And we have a ridge in the west. And um, this trough will continue to be enforced as several pieces of energy flow in the northwest flow around the base of the trough. Now, um, in, the, in the northwest, we had the strong uh, Pacific flow of moisture coming in to the northwest, and this should be weakening by Sunday. And we'll take a look at this at the surface. You see, we still have some precipitation occurring across the Cascades. Lighter precipitation will be likely through Monday before another increase in precipitation happens. Lighter precipitation is forecast across into the Rockies. Now we'll look at this at the surface. Now we see like there's several pieces of energy that will be coming through now concerning the system that might be affecting portions of the east, the northeast. We go here to Saturday night. Here we have snow breaking out here. This is GFS into central western Pennsylvania and the Ohio Valley. And then as we go through the period, it kind of lifts to the north. But look how far south the 540 line goes down to central uh, Virginia right here. And then the low lifts out. There could be snow even closer to the I-95 corridor. Now, uh, we'll look at the other models. This is the um, the European. Um, no, here's the European. And similar. And it dives the system further to the south and out. And then we look at the um, European ensembles. And it's also south. Now we'll look at the other models too. We'll look at the um, we'll look at what can we look at the UK Met, and here we are at Saturday. Wait, this isn't the right one. Okay, here we go. And uh, here we are Saturday and Sunday, the system is further out here. Here's the UK Met, it's further off the uh, Virginia, North Carolina coast. And we can look at the, um, the uh, NAM. I don't know if I chose the right one. Let's see how that goes. And it just goes out to uh, Sunday morning. And you can see here's the low right here over the Ohio Valley. So that kind of lags behind the other models. So um, most of the precipitation, I think, will be across the interior northeast. Okay, we're going to look now at the period for December 3rd to the 7th. And we still have our region in the west, trough in the east. The positive height anomalies here near Greenland weekend. And slide further to the east as we go through the period. We come third to seven, so we're seeing a lifting out. So all in all, we still have our, our ridge trough configuration. So for this forecast period, I'm calling for above normal temperatures here. And I'm calling for anomalies at eight degrees or more above normal, mainly cross push of the southwest. And below normal temperatures are forecast here with the numbers of 2 to 4 degrees below normal for precipitation. Calling for below normal precipitation for much of this region here. And the probability of occurrence is 35%. Okay, looking at the period for. December 6th to the 12th, or 8th to the 12th. The pattern remains generally the same, generally unchanged here. We still have our ridge trough configuration and the positive anomalies near Greenland 
keep continue to lift to the east, but we have the same pattern. So for this forecast period, I'm calling for above normal temperatures here and anomalies of 6 to 12 degrees above normal, mainly here. Below normal temperatures are here with 2 to 4 degrees anomalies for here and for precipitation calling for above normal precipitation for the northwest the northeast and the northern middle atlantic probability of currents is 35 percent and then we have below normal precipitation for this region here and the probability of occurrence is 35 to 40 percent that's the long range weather forecast discussion for november 28th through december 12th thanks for coming jim mumlin's world of weather and have a good day